Hello Aries, welcome to your weekly general reading for the week of June 13th, 2021. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you for all the likes and subscribes and shares. Really appreciate it. So what do you need to know for this week? What does Aries need to know for this week? Wow. You're not the first sign. The, the couple of the signs, even Taurus, I mean... Only one set of cards had anything to say. Aries. Whoa. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> huh. Knight of Swords. Wow. This is that uh, Sir Lancelot. Right, charging in, not thinking about what he's doing, gets in there, but he counts on his charm to get him out. Could be dealing with an air sign, Libra, uh, Gemini, or Aquarius. And look at that, another air sign, younger air sign, Page of Swords. Talks about quick thinking. Could also be uh, talking about uh, spying or someone who is in uh, law enforcement. And the Eight of Pentacles, working hard and enjoying it. So you got quite the reading here going, Aries, don't you? <laughs> Are you like uh, charging in? Possibly, uh, hmm. Or are you just running roughshod over some air sign, checking them out? Are you like checking out their social media? <laughs> That's what it makes me think of. That's what's coming to mind. So, wow, there's so much air here and it's Aries. And find out more about this. What is going on for you guys? So, Knight of Swords. Tell us about the Knight of Swords. Because right now it looks like you're just working hard at uh, quick thinking and just doing whatever you want here. What you got here? Well, Knight of Swords. You got the Ten of Rods and the Nine of Swords. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, oh. So the Knight of Swords talks about, you know, saving and just brashly going in. And uh, so apparently this has caused you a certain amount of trouble <laughs> and anxiety. But this is coming to an end. I mean, the Ten of Rods, you know, the burden is almost over. So, you know... You're worried about it, but it, it's almost there. You're almost done with this, uh, whatever this is. I don't even know what this is yet. Page of Swords. Let's see. It's almost like you have a compulsion of doing things that you shouldn't do. And you're trying to get under control. Page of Swords. Yeah, see, Page of Swords. You got the King of Rods with the Eight of Pentacles again. So you're working on this. You're working on being a better version of you, Aries. See, King of Rods, that's you. And this is working hard. So I really think that this is, maybe with this page of swords is thinking, quick thinking about how to be a better version of you and how to work on being that. And that's why the Eight of Pentacles is here. So it seems to me that you're just trying to work on yourself. Yeah, Queen of Rods. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Queen of Rods and the King of Rods. This is a divine relationship. You're working on yourself. Working on yourself leads to meeting your divine counterpart, your other half, because this is a, this is the King and Queen. Wow. Wow. Could also be another fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. <gasps> I love it. So you work on you and really get you going and that's what happens. You end up becoming, be meeting, getting involved with your divine counterpart, your, <laughs> I love it. I love it. Your, your, your other part. Love it. Okay, let's see here. Let's get you a spellcasting oracle card for Aries, who is working on themselves and 
trying to make themselves a better person. Let's see here. Wow. Do you know that another, actually another uh, sign got this card? And I have never gotten this card. And now I've gotten it twice in one night. Finding. And I, it's like finding you. And that's exactly what happens with the other, with the other one. Is I think of this card and she's in a wedding dress. But I don't see, I, well, I guess if you have the king and queen of rods, anything is possible. But to me, it's almost like this butterfly, the symbol of transformation. It came out of her. Because look at the way she, it's almost like she's bursting. Like she's just so happy. This is finding you. Finding, loving you. And that's what I think you're working on. You're working on yourself. You're working on making yourself a better person. And by making yourself feel, you know, working on you, you actually attract and manifest your your other part, your, your divine person that's so cool well aries congratulations keep up the good work because the results are looking pretty awesome <laughs> thank you so much you take care good luck bye